gents. Today I'm not actually unboxing. I want to give a comparison review of the experience of renting suits and tuxes from Men's Warehouse and from the Black Tux. This year I was in two different weddings. I was the best man in one and a groomsman in the other. And for each of them we had to rent tuxes. Now you may have seen my previous video. I did a video just about the black tux when I did that for my wedding. I'll link to that up above. We rented eight or nine tuxes from them for all of my groomsmen and for the fathers within the wedding. And then from Men's Warehouse, I've rented about a dozen times between proms, dances, and everything else that you go through as you're growing up. And so this year, not only did I rent from Men's Warehouse for one of the weddings, but I rented from the black tux for the other. Every clothing company or product that I look at, I try to evaluate on the same scale. I always try to evaluate based on quality, fit, style, price, and the overall experience. And so I'll talk about each of those points with the two companies for the easiest comparison between the two, because ultimately you want to spend your money in the best way and you want to get the best experience. And then all of the other things kind of fall into place. The idea of men's warehouse, I think is much more appealing than the black tux, but in practice, that's where things start to fall apart. The idea of Men's Warehouse is you have one store you can go to, it's full of experts that help you get the proper tailored fit and they get the proper suit for you, but ultimately what you end up having is a mall store full of minimum wage teenagers supervised by an adult and they know some things about the suits. What I really experienced with mine was I went in with my brother who was one of the groomsmen for the wedding for Men's Warehouse and even though the suit really didn't look good on him, the pants were too big, the, the jacket was too big, the two um, teenagers, they, made, they were 18, 19 years old, were like, hey man, you look great, uh, you, know, you look really good in that, I think I might have a higher standard of what looks like a good fit, but if you walk out of a dressing room and somebody tells you you don't look good and you need to switch everything out, that isn't conducive to great customer service, but if you walk out and say, hey, you look great, then you're gonna walk out with the suit, even though it might not fit properly. And so that's where some of the ideas between find the men's warehouse fall down. Now, for the black tux, you are able to put in your own measurements on the website. They ship you the suit in advance, then you can do all of your own edits and changes there. So it's not as much of hand-holding, but the biggest thing with the experience is I had to spend a lot of time just driving to men's warehouse going into the store it's the only reason I had to go into the mall and when I picked up my men's warehouse suit it didn't fit I had to get a new jacket I had to get new pants and I had to get a new shirt for whatever reason I got measured twice when I traveled to New York a few times I went in several months before the wedding I got measured I went back about a month before they shipped the suits in order to make sure that nothing changed and they still got it wrong. And so not only did I have to drive out to Men's Warehouse to pick it up, I had to come home, I had to wait, I had to go back just two days before the wedding in order to pick up the proper suit, then I had to drive home. So that's a lot of time spent driving. Whereas with a black tux, you do have to take the time to measure yourself or have your wife measure you or somebody else, but they have a really easy walkthrough process online. And then for the suits for the wedding, we actually received ours two weeks before the wedding, so we had plenty of time before the wedding to try it on and make sure it fit and if there was anything wrong they would exchange it for us which is what ended up happening for a few of the groomsmen in my wedding party is the jackets were too small we emailed our black tux concierge and they overnight shipped a new jacket out and we had plenty of time for everybody to try them on and make sure they fit before the wedding so the overall experience for men's warehouse is nice that they measure you and make sure you fit but having to go to a physical location is not as convenient as doing it all in your home, getting it shipped to you, and you can get it shipped anywhere. If you will be at like a destination wedding, they'll ship it to the hotel or something else, and I find the Black Tux's experience to be much more straightforward and much easier, especially from a time perspective. What's also interesting is when you talk about price. So you'd expect that Men's Warehouse, the much larger company, might have better prices, they do more rentals or anything else, but instead, they have a lot of overhead that they need to pay for, they have a lot of mall lease rentals and stores and everything else and, and employees. And so my men's warehouse rental was $235 with tax and my black tux rental was 205. And we got ostensibly the same tuxes. We got uh, tux, shirt, bow tie, shoes, everything else. And so the price difference between the black tux and men's warehouse is in favor of the black tux and that dovetails right into the quality. The quality of the Black Tux rentals are much higher. So not only is the jacket 100% merino wool, but they also have higher quality shirts, the pants are nicer, and the shoe comparison, it, it drove me crazy with Men's Warehouse. They had these uh, just like boxy, cheap shoes, and with the Black Tux rental, they had much more modern, better looking shoes, and you know, Men's Warehouse very well might offer higher quality, nicer shoes, but you'd have to pay for those. And in this comparison, we're, we're basically looking at the same price for the same tux, but better stuff 
from the black tux. Quality also brings us right into fit. So whether or not you have the highest quality Armani suit, if it doesn't fit, you're not going to look good. The black tux is a much more modern take on the tux rental. Men's Warehouse seems to have not updated their suits based on modern slim fits. Even though I got a slim fit shirt from Men's Warehouse, it really didn't fit. I'll have both of my videos of the try-ons set here, but the shirt really didn't fit. It was my exact size. It was a 15 and a half, 34, 35 slim fit but it was very baggy in the torso, it was very baggy in the sleeves, and it was just a really thin, it didn't feel very good. The black tux shirt, the sleeves were a little bit big, but the slim fit pit fit perfectly around my torso, and the collar was much sturdier, it felt more premium, and it was a much better fit, not only on the shirt, the jacket fit me better, the sleeve length and the slimmer fit. It also was shorter, which the men's warehouse one was a little bit longer, which looks a little more uh, of an older style. And when it comes to pants, it was no comparison. The slim fit pants and the black tucks fit extremely well. They had a nice taper down to my ankle, and the length was, was good, but the men's warehouse ones were a lot more frumpy, uh, bigger around the butt and those were considered a slim fit, but I don't really believe it. This is interesting. Both of the rentals had pre-tied bow ties, but this one has a lot more flexibility and give to it, almost like it would have been not pre-tied. And uh, I like that a lot. So nice one from the Black Tux. And again, at the same price, the shoes look way better from the Black Tux. Keep in mind, this is not a sponsored video. I don't have any relationship with Men's Warehouse or the Black Tux, although Men's Warehouse might not be happy about what I'm saying in this video. But what I want to really help with is on your wedding day, or if you're going to a fundraiser, gala, any, anything you need to rent a suit for, you want to have the best fit, quality, price, and you want to spend your money wisely. And so from my experience of renting twice with a Black Tux and dozens of times with the Men's Warehouse, it might seem weird that you're ordering from a company that's only online and they're gonna ship it to you and everything else, but I just want to help instill confidence that you're much better off with a better fitting, higher quality, great priced suit from the Black Tux versus the big uh, stale conglomerate of the Men's Warehouse. Not only through the pickup process at the store, but the day after your event, you must have your tux back to Men's Warehouse. So if your wedding is on a Saturday, your event is registered as that day, you need to have your suit back on Sunday or they will charge you $20 per day as a late fee, which I actually ran into because I didn't, I didn't know that I had to have it back on Sunday and I took it back on Tuesday. They did waive one of the days because I called them and I told them I didn't know because I honestly didn't. But with the black tux, all you do is slap on a UPS label and drop it off at the UPS store, ship it off and you're good to go. Now at my office, we get UPS deliveries all the time. So I was able to just take it to work. I dropped it at the front door and the UPS guy took it and it's all taken care of. So a much more streamlined process, not only for picking up and receiving your tux, but also for sending it back and getting it off your hands. I have thought about diving into the economics of the two companies. I truly think that Men's Warehouse should be frightened by not only the growth, but the high quality and the better experience of the Black Tux and you have affinity from customers like me who have great experiences through the process and want to continue ordering and to spread the word to other guys like you. If you have any other questions about the Black Tux, the experience of using it for your wedding or anything else, I talked about it in my video that I would link to in the beginning. And if you don't have those questions answered in that video, feel free to comment over there or right down below and I'll do my best to answer. I hope this video was helpful for anybody considering renting through the two companies. Again, independent thoughts, these are just my experiences and I have become a very uh, big loyal fan of the Black Tux through this process. I really want to buy one of my own tuxes so I always have it, but until then, happy to rent from them. Thank you to everybody who subscribes to my channel. Please do if you already aren't to learn about the best menswear on the internet, specifically companies like the Black Tux, online only, great high quality product, great value for their prices because there's really nothing better than looking your best and if you've been wearing the same company for many years, time to take a look because this is the best time to be a guy and get great menswear. Stay tuned for future videos, gents, and until next time, this is The Cavalier.